friend Jean-Serge Gagnon here so do you want to know how you get hundreds more uh, thousands of viewers on Pinterest in just a few days just a couple of little tweaks and you're going to be getting hundreds of thousands of monthly viewers I mean from like five I had like five monthly viewers I was doing everything I was supposed to I, mean, I was posting regularly I was pinning things I was like you know um, uh, sharing things and creating boards and sharing my blog posts and my videos and everything onto my Pinterest tags or uh, what they call them uh, not tags um well you know Pinterest boards right and I was doing all that and I was getting like nothing I mean Pinterest was on the side it wasn't something I was even caring about I was just kind of doing it because it was just part of my daily stuff but I was not getting any you know real results right I was not getting any real results I was like ah Pinterest isn't really meant for me right but just recently I found something and now um oh my god I'm going to show you this in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so I was so excited as you can see I called it pin pin credible results pin credible results I actually call this uh, I don't even have that link do I uh, I'm going to create a new link here I'm going to put it right here in my in my uh, in my screen here I'm going to call it pin credible pin credible I actually registered that domain you can actually go to http colon pin credible results.com you can actually go to that domain pin credible results pin credible let's just put an uppercase here pin credible results you can actually go to pin whoops there's only one e pin credible results it's like incredible results right but it's Pinterest and well I gotta change the color here let's just change the color we're gonna make this uh let's make it what's I guess Pinterest is kind of a red right let's make that like this and then let's make the background white and let's make it transparent a bit here let's just do this like this there we go so pin credible results actually that's too big isn't it let's get that smaller so you can actually see it but if you go to pin credible results pin credible results.com you can actually see on my blog I actually create create a page here let me just share that with you pin credible results.com you actually end up on one of my blog pages here let's share the screen uh, where's that that's right there over here share the screen share the screen pin credible results just uh, there we go so pin credible results takes you to this page which kind of shows you what I had last I guess that's last week or something but when I started right I had five monthly viewers it's totally ridiculous right getting five monthly viewers I was getting no traction on Pinterest let me actually this screen let me just resize this so you can actually see the whole thing let's move that over to here well, actually I gotta do that let's do this like this and then let's resize that like like so all right so this is just my little bot that's telling me that all right so pit credible results I was actually getting you know and and I went I started doing this this change and I got I started getting these insane results look at that this is the 23rd of July right here and it's been growing 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 like the weekend over here where I'm not as active but look at that one million percent increase 70k total audience I, I wish I had a screenshot of what it looked like before before I did I I mean it just says zero impressions zero 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 and now it says 119k 11 saves 253 link clicks right if we go to the actual results right now well first first let me show you what I'm talking about when I say look at that 91k monthly viewers right I have it doesn't I don't where does it say the number of followers I have it doesn't really say right but if I go to say for example 
this is Gary V look he's got 115,000 followers I'm almost there I'm almost at a at 100,000 uh, uh, Ray Higdon he's got 69k um if I look at oh this is just a search I look at um well see this one here has got eight only 839 only 839 you know it's nice you know it's a it's a network marketing business or whatever she says that he, she helps people build their business she's got nice nice style pins here whatever right so and if you see this is you know looks like not not a, it's a decent you know site if I go to say some of these other ones Jim Edwards he's got 67,000 if I look at uh, marketing digibook I don't know what that is I just searched for you know marketing or whatever and I found this 138,000 why did they why is that right this one here has got 104,000 um this one here has got 76,000 right this one here has got 85,000 this one here has got 43,000 right this one has got 85,000 and this one has got 241 241 so this one I was like okay why does this one have this and when I look at the pins there this is their boards so whenever you go to Pinterest you can go like say for example I look at go back to Gary V here if I just look the default view is this uh and then you can do see all boards right here which kind of shows you the boards right so I guess activity is that how how you go yeah right so there's see all boards right here so these are all his boards right how many pins he's got on different boards what he what he posts right if I look at this this other this person here Laura when I was at activity right here the default was this right it's like okay she's posting some stuff she's got 776 pins in this featured board right uh, what's she doing different right if I say see all boards well one of the things I see right here which by the way I'm not doing this but I think it's kind of cool that when you look at the boards you can see all the boards have like a title to them right and when you look at any Pinterest boards normally it's just like this where it, but she probably started I guess with these and then she decided to make these specific you know boards with with a with a, a header if you will right title anyway she's getting 241 so what are people doing to get that many views if I look at this one this is another board that didn't have a lot I mean it's it's got 549 monthly viewers and look they got a cute cat so why, why is it not getting them a lot of views right if I click on I guess this one here I can't even see all boards oh I'm already on all boards if I click on activities this is what I see right the default view is this which is I don't know just like somebody's uh, you know a post a post or whatever see all boards shows me their boards that they have right here the number of pins on there 80 pins 11 pins 16 pins so what are they doing what are they doing what am I doing what's what's the difference in 549 monthly viewers or me which was you know five <laughs> five monthly viewers you can see right there five right I did have four thousand followers four thousand two hundred followers and you know that's uh, how do you get just five monthly views right how does that so anyways the platforms do their thing right the platforms do their thing and like I said if you go to actually I should probably add that link to this to this one here I want to add existing it's going to be interesting there it is incredible and I have to resize this there if you go to pin credible results like I said this is the page you're going to see some I'm going to add some other stuff but look if you look at the, when I first started this thing the next day or two days or one day July 23rd right here you know 20 24th whatever two days later I had 3,000 impressions right versus like I said zero right zero impressions right here business hub zero impressions right and uh and then this is like a week later right the 10 days or so August 2nd from July well whatever right 88,000 and I'm I'm just right now at 90 something and I and that basically what happened is I did something for two three days that first beginning there I did a change in what I was doing the kinds of stuff I was posting how I was doing it and then all of a sudden I got this great big spike and now I've I've kind of I haven't really done the same thing I did the first few days because it do it did take some effort 
so I I'm not able to do that every single day right but I'm kind of learning the different things that make a big difference on Pinterest and I'm doing those things and we're going to see like yesterday I did a bit more activity around that that particular thing that makes a huge difference you might be thinking oh, what is it what's the thing what's the thing well let's let me just like I said back up here I'm going to show you the current my current um, um uh, my, my current analytics what it looks like right so today as of right now well actually it's as of yesterday right because with Pinterest the metrics don't update until 24 or 48 hours later you can see right here that my um you know my activity isn't as good in the last few days right like I said I was doing less but this day here which is July 30th when we look at those other pictures you know July 25th even here right July this is this would be the 29th this would be the 30th right here 31st and then August 1st and 2nd right so if we go back to here you can see right there July 31st August 1st you know so it's kind of similar they update they updated but still it is 127,000 127,000 impressions compared to uh, 88,000 a few days ago right so that's what I get here now what else what else is interesting about Pinterest is that the people that are there are actually people who are actually going to click on your stuff look at this video standard what 10 that 10k impressions 9,000 7,000 2,000 1,800 right so I'm getting all these things and um what is it what else uh what else what else what else uh wanted to show you all right over here so this is the pins it shows me how many link clicks I got 198 clicks 25 clicks 54 clicks and that do you get clicks do you get that many clicks on Facebook on LinkedIn on other platforms you get that many clicks people actually clicking to your site like if I look at the if I look at the over here I just look at link clicks you'll see it's not you know it's not like millions right nine seventy three whatever it's still over the last few days it's a lot less uh I'm, I'm looking into why that is but I'm guessing that it has to do with some of the you know what happens is on like any other social media platform it's very very um organized uh, or controlled by the community right so if somebody that you're, so for me I've I've got 4,000 followers right now it's 3,600 something but for me is like anybody who's been following me in the past might have been into bitcoins or cryptocurrencies or they're not necessarily into the stuff I'm doing right now so they will report my pins as being stuff they don't want to see right and platforms are like that if so if you have a lot of followers from before and you've changed sort of what you're doing sort of what your you know metrics are sort of what you're what you're actually wanting to do if you change that then you gotta you gotta you gotta make sure you know you gotta make sure that you're not you're not uh doing the you so you're not you, no you can't make sure of anything that's the thing what I'm trying to say is that you you're gonna you're going to get some issues with that right you're going to get people that are going to block you it's going to be that's just how it is right that's just how it is people on Pinterest are not are no different than other social media platforms they will report you if they're not interested in what you're peddling right whatever it is you're promoting whether it's promotion or whether it's you know personal stuff right if I look at my boards I got a lot of stuff here courses webinars course talk you know <laughs> and I used to have you know f uh, <laughs> um, exercise related stuff success tips parenting um, you know Instagram post network marketing blogging all these things you know that's what I that's what I've been doing in the past and now I'm doing my blogging my course income secret stuff right so it's a little different you can see here a bunch of courses and things like that some videos from TikTok other uh, things like that so what is it that I'm doing you want to know what I'm doing I don't know I don't know if I can actually tell you and even if I did does it mean that what if, if you did the same thing it would do the same thing for you I'm not sure but one thing I did discover and this is this is this is one of the things maybe this is exactly what you need to do I don't know but one of the things I discovered is up here first of all business account so you gotta make sure you convert to business stuff. if you have a regular account oops so we're already on this page click on edit profile uh, let's get the pin credible results out of there where 
object I gotta go here there we go so I mean okay so you have an account right and where is it oh actually it's not going to be on mine because I've already done it uh under account settings down the bottom here if you have a personal account there's going to be a change to business or add business or I forget what it was but you just do that it's free so that's the first thing first thing make sure you have a business account right number one make sure you have a business account next once you have a business account next you're going to be able to you're going to be able to just go in and start to promote certain things that you couldn't do before without the business account you can't do it and even though I converted my business account a year or more ago right I did that a long time ago because I it, I guess it was new back then whenever I did it and I just did it right it's just like I converted the business account it was easy just click a button do this go there and that's what I did right and so after you've got your business account now I'm you'll have analytics you also have ads obviously oh and by the way me I'm doing just a few ads so if I look back at my analytics over here let's just show you back this here you can see that my overall my overall impressions is uh you know up by 374,000 my total audience is up by 1 million 344,000 percent right 1 million 344,000 but there's some paid in there so if I just go here and I change that to organic only right now it shows me organic only but even then look at that 1 million that's organic 1 million is organic 270 so I'm not spending that much money if I look at the ads where are my ads is that here no the ads are in here if I just look at the ads no overview that I've just set up a few ads and really that's not necessarily but you see I spent 25 dollars I guess what is that is that over the last certain period or last seven, oh, last seven days so let's just say last 30 days last 30 days I spent 40 50 bucks I got 36 game impressions 282 clicks five save and these are the ads these are the number of I spent all it is is just you promote a pin you go into your uh you go into here you go to your pins wherever your pins are right if I go in here for example and I look at my boards I can look at the boards and I can say okay you know what I'm going to promote let's promote something right I have no idea what but let's go in here uh, something that maybe will get people onto my course income site let's say this let's let's do this one so you go to any of your pins you see how it says promote 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 I'm going to just click on this promote right here and then I'm just going to say this goes to this page I'm going to spend one dollar a day total of 10 days and promote I can say run continuously if I want right but anyways right now I'm just going to do that and there's a expanded targeting I forget what the searching top okay well that's fine so I'm just gonna go promote like this and done and that's it now I've got this one here who's what's being promoted I can from maybe what is this one is this clicky course as well my potatoes uh let's promote this one too why not promote they make it really easy right <laughs> it's so simple anyways okay so now if I go back to ads here you can see in the in this over the last 30 days that that's what I did now if I go back to do, 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 if I go back to uh analytics again I just want to go to analytics and show you again yeah so if I go here if I click on paid and organic which is just the paid stuff you know it's like if I compare 21k right and organic 73 right so it's it's not it's not as that um it's not that small but it also is just like 50 bucks it's like insane for 50 bucks <laughs> for 50 bucks I got all those clicks and all those visits and all this stuff right so it's really insane so by the way you do need to have your uh your uh where is that uh, reporting conversions I'm trying to remember where that is uh, no there's a anyways you need to add your 
well you don't need to you can still just create ads and send people to a website but if you want to keep track of who's uh, growing your audience and do retargeting you need to put a pinterest a pinterest uh tagging on your page right on your website so if I go to my website here um, just go to my wordpress uh site like I said I'm not exact I'll have to you can always google it figure out where it was but if I go in here and I go into my uh headers where is it tools tools headers settings headers headers right here by on my blog I have different headers right I've got the pin I've got the which one is this this is the Google Analytics this one here is the Facebook pixel this one here is the LinkedIn one this one is uh yeah that's still LinkedIn this is Pinterest right here Pinterest tag so I basically added the Pinterest tag right here which is the code that you see on the this is my ID obviously you don't want to use you don't want to use that as a um as yours that's mine but the rest of the code anyway so wherever that is I I don't like I said I don't remember where that is in here but I know that when you go in the ads let's see what happens if I just create ads is that where that is new ad group for traffic conversions catalog video views uh, campaign name oh look anyways I haven't done this is kind of like this uh, the default is whatever but I'm sure you can uh, I'm sure you can do a lot more so if I go in here WordPress no settings maybe book it, it's got to be in your anyways so the other thing you want to make sure too is you want to make sure you claim your website right you gotta put a code on it and stuff like that on there claim your other accounts Instagram YouTube they have Shopify and Etsy I don't know what I don't have those so I didn't do that but this kind of points to the right YouTube I'm not even sure what that does but um yeah and then what else create maybe no yeah uh video trends what is trends people trends oh that I guess that's trends what you should it's the same as other social media platforms where you can go and check out who really I have early access oh that's cool that's very nice isn't that nice that I have air fryer zucchini chips zucchini recipes interesting zucchini zucchini peach cobblers huh anyway so that's okay so let's just uh, go back here to uh analytics ads what did I want to show you there is uh something else I'm trying to remember what it was but under boards here you can actually look at if I click on this board does it take me to the board yeah it takes me to the board so if I look at that board which is my top board 3000 does it show me anything here so you can see here the number of, of plays the number of seconds viewed per video right five seconds on average 47 seconds well there's only one play uh five seconds nine seconds see look at that 600 900 800 400 4 7 12 it's insane there's some of them are zero I guess zero I don't know why right Pinterest would decide not to show those to anybody um some of them I promoted but most of them I did not I promoted like maybe 10 videos right and like this one here has one play right to, for 12 seconds whoever watched that for 12 seconds Just, but that's the thing so as you get people watching your stuff you can capture them using the Pinterest uh pin and like I said pin credible results you're going to see things that eventually I'm going to have a course that I'm going to put together to explain all this how all this works and I'm going to be able to show you that and in, in uh, there's going to be a link here so pin credible results or maybe pin credible results will go to a course or to a webinar or something else right depending on what what happens but that's the thing with buying domains when you have your own domain you can actually make it go to wherever you want right and like I said all this stuff here all these um you know incredible stuff right if I look at this look 700 8434 826 at 360 it's insane how many <laughs> views I get in just 10 days I've only been I've only been using like I said I've only been doing this for just a few days right here right this is just a few days of doing a certain activity right so I mean it's insane how quickly 
they are growing my audience look at that 33k 23k even the days that it's been less busy I get three 4k 3k I don't know what it's going to be tomorrow because I like I said it's been a few days and yesterday I did some some of the posting so here's what you do you go to create you create pin or create ad right so create pin you can do it right here and then in here you add your title and you put you say what you want you can also uh so you can put a video or an or a, an image here right uh, so whatever the videos and then what else under and then when you oh the other way is if you go here to your actual profile like this right and you go to boards you're going to go to a board let's say I want to add another board another video here I'm going to go to that board I'm going to go straight to here plus pin and I'm going to just you know find a video right <clears throat> over here wherever they are right whatever video I want to put in here whatever post I want to do or something right so that's kind of all you do you just create and you post and that's it so what else what else business hub I don't know what there's a home feed for the business hub is that any different oh that's just based on your followers or based on other things you've done before yeah okay there's so much stuff right I haven't really uh I haven't really spent a lot of time on Pinterest itself I don't I don't really want to spend too much time on Pinterest because it is a platform that that's just like any other platform there's things to learn you gotta do things a certain way you gotta you gotta you know it's like just you have to go through the motions right and it takes a while for you to learn all the things that you need to know to do what the right thing on the platform so are you doing are you getting a million new viewers a month a million viewers a month on your stuff one million well I'm not I'm not getting a million I'm getting a hundred thousand or almost a hundred thousand right but is it's how do you get there right how do you get that to that point right how do you get to this look 91,000 91,200 monthly viewers insane right pin credible it is pin credible pin credible results pin credible results go to pin credible results.com pin whoops wrong one yeah pin credible results.com here let's make it smaller put it there there and actually I'm going to make this uh, a bit darker uh, I want the background to be a little bit more there we go there so pin credible pin credible results.com you're going to go and find the current state of the thing and every few days I'm going to add stuff so you can kind of see where I'm at so you know after two weeks I'm at 88k now well it's not two weeks that was actually 10 days I probably update that to fix that but anyways now I'm at two weeks and I'm at 90k right almost 90k 89 89 point where is it it's over here 80 91 91.2 91.2 all right so hopefully you enjoyed this and if you have questions let me know and don't forget to share because somebody needs to hear this message somebody else is wanting to grow their viewers and you can't hide it from them tell them tell them about it learn it tell them or share my video that would be awesome I would really appreciate it we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom Ooh. some of your friends need to hear this message so don't forget to share for more content like this go to courseincomesecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon until next time